Hello guys and welcome to my channel. For today's tutorial I'm actually going to um, be painting the bottom of the shoe. Specifically I'm going to paint a zebra print pattern onto the shoe. Okay the first thing you want to do is get a piece of paper and practice making zebra print. You might want to look at a picture while you're doing this. That should help. Okay so right now I'm going to paint the shoe white. Okay, and so I'm going to let the shoe dry before I add another coat. Okay, so I'm going to allow the shoe to dry one more time and I'm probably going to add maybe one or two more coats of the white paint to the shoe. Okay, so once again, I'm going to allow the shoe to dry. I'll probably do one more coat, but just around the edges here. Okay, so right now I'm taking this smaller brush. There's a close-up of it. Much smaller than this one is the one I was using. So, just a comparison. And right now I'm going to go over the edges. Here's a close-up of exactly what I'm doing. Okay, let the shoe dry. That's about as many layers as I'm going to put on it. And next what you're going to do is take a permanent marker with a fine point. And the shoe has to be completely dry. And what we're gonna do is start drawing on the zebra stripes with this, and then we're gonna go over it with black paint. Okay guys, so here is the print I created and there are some problems like right here. I wasn't for sure what I was doing and others like right here, but that they can be solved by literally just painting since I'm filling them in. It doesn't matter. Taking a small brush, my small brush, I'm going to actually go and fill in all of these little squiggly lines with black acrylic paint. That's what the bottom looks like. As you can see, I did have some mistakes, but I just filled them in. You just want to do the best you can. There's the heel back here. Okay, so the last thing you want to do is put some type of sealer on the shoe to um, protect the, the paint work and everything. So I have two sealers that you can use. You can use the Mod Podge <clears throat> Gloss Luster Clear Acrylic Sealer. And this is an aerosol can. You need to be, I would say you need to be outside when you use this. And I'm actually going to use this on this shoe. But the second thing you can use is regular Mod Podge. And um, this is a glue. And you just basically put the glue over this section the painted section and you let it dry and it takes about eight hours to dry so it is a long process but um 
either one works uh, they both do the same thing it's just this one is super fat so right now I'm about to go outside and spray the shoe with this and it only takes 15 minutes to dry I sprayed the shoe with the uh, Mod Podge gloss and here's what it looks like I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Bye everyone.